Hey there. Just got this knife on eBay for $9.98. So, say 10 bucks. Free shipping. It's uh, made in China. It's a K380S. And it's got the Batman theme. Joker, why so serious? So let's take a look. It's got a little Batman logo on it. That's kind of cool. This is a spring assisted. This is not a switchblade. It's assisted, which means it snaps out similar to a switchblade, but technically it's not because you still have to flip a little, you still have to start the process manually. It's got a little keychain ring or you can wear it around your neck lanyard hole and I'm a six foot guy over 200 pounds you know that that handle fits perfect in my, in my meaty hand so you take this and pull it toward you bang it just flips out it's nice and sharp it's ground on one side this side is is flat you can see on the serrations that uh, just ground on one side. This side is blunt. It's not sharpened. And it's a linear lock. You can see that there. How it uh, goes off center like that just to lock it out. So it's not a lock back or anything like that. It's um, got a hollow back so there's no, you know, when it's open it's you can see through it. Um, it's a decent little knife for the for the money paid. The only thing I don't like about it is the fact that it creaks when you close it. I did it real slow so that you could really hear that, but when you close it, you know it creaks. But I mean that's a pretty small thing not to like about it. I'm not gonna send it back or, you know, want a refund or anything for it, just for that, um, because I like it. It's kind of cool. So, just wanted to give a quick review and show it off a little bit. And sometimes, right at this point, it sounds like the spring almost catches on the out swing. But uh, maybe it just needs some oil. But I know that spring steel, spring steel is really fragile, and that concerns me a little bit. So I'll, um, what I'm going to do is fill this little reservoir up with oil and let it sink down in overnight, and then I'll put it upside down on a on a rag for a day and let it seat back out so it oils that well. I could take the four screws out too and uh, manually put the oil in there, but I'll, I'll try the easy soaking method first. So anyway, I don't want this to be a real long video, but if you're thinking about getting this knife, get it. I mean, it's 10 bucks, you know, and it's, it's pretty slick. It's pretty impressive. So, there it is. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope it helps you in your purchase decision. Um, And that's it. So, thanks for viewing the video. Uh, add and subscribe to me, and uh, I'll subscribe back. Why so serious?